Hi, I'm Andrew from Brickmeister Z. But what's the difference compared to a Lego camera that films movies and another Lego camera that takes pictures? Well, in this video, we're going to compare two different Lego camera sets. The Disney camera and the Polaroid camera. The Disney camera is actually a movie camera that films different movies. And of course, I got this last year to celebrate Disney's 100th anniversary. And the Polaroid camera is actually a LEGO Ideas project made by me, Brick Productions, which just was released this year. And I believe this is a camera that actually takes pictures. So let's take a look at those two different camera sets and which features are actually different between the two. For customization, the Disney camera has the number 100 next to the reels. But what's interesting that I found is that you can remove the number 1 and replace it with a round 2x2 two two tile. And as you can see, this actually matches up to the back of that other reel. And the same thing happens with the Polaroid camera when you actually remove those stickered tiles. You can take out this one that represents the One Step SX-70 camera. And you can replace it with this one, the number 1000, which is something like the 1000 Land camera. As for the play features, the Disney camera has this crank at the front that you can turn. And you can actually listen to the sound of how a film projects on the screen. Unless you're like at a movie theater watching a movie. <laughs> and the play feature for the Polaroid camera is quite different compared to the Disney camera. You can open up this compartment to insert one of the photos. Close that up. And we press the red button at the front. It actually takes a picture, just like back in the day. The Polaroid camera has three different photo cards when you take your pictures. And the Disney camera has this film strip that actually shows scenes from the different movies. And by rotating the two cameras, you can see how the lenses are actually a different design between the two. And for the inside, there's a back compartment on the Disney camera that you can open up. And inside, you can put Walt Disney sitting at his movie desk right there. And behind that, we have some Technic pieces that does touch that little gear right there. And that is one of the mechanisms that is used for this crank. And one difference for the inside of the Polaroid camera is that you can actually take off these back panels just like this. And there are a lot of different Technic pieces. And if you're curious about the inside, this is how you insert the photo right here. And look at that. Close that up. And then take a picture. All the mechanisms push forward just like that. And one last thing to point out is the different side builds. The Disney camera itself has minifigures and this multi-camera build on this display stand. But when you remove all of these, it actually shows that this is a clapperboard. And that's really cool of how you can start recording your favorite movies. And then for the Polaroid camera, this one does not have any minifigures in that set. But this one actually uses a film pack that you can actually store the photos inside there. And by pairing both of them, we have a clever camera display piece. <laughs> but that is it for this comparison video for the LEGO Disney camera and the LEGO Polaroid camera. This was so much fun comparing the two different features like how I did with the NES and the Pac-Man set a couple of months back. But I'll be interested in comparing some more LEGO sets in some future videos. But let me know in the comments which LEGO camera is better. Don't forget to subscribe to Brickmeister Z for more videos. And I'll see you again next time. Bye.